Hey, how are you going? Welcome. Hope you're having a fantastic day wherever you are in the world. Oh, if you're watching in, in the future, hello. I hope it's better than what we're living through at the moment. I'm going to share a few sort of interesting things. been looking into uh, telescopes and the Vatican one, but I'm just going to do a quick one on this one. Okay, this is a list of theories that are notable. Many theories relate to the Candlestein plans and elaborate plots. Used theories usually deny a consensus and cannot be proven using historical scientific method and are not to be confused with research in concerning verified theories such as that one. In principle, the theories are not always false by default and their validity depends on the evidence just as any theory. However, they are often discredited a pare due to the cumbersome and improbable nature of many of them. Psychologists usually attribute the belief in a theory and finding a theory where there is none of the number of psychologists pathological conditions such as paranoia, schizophrenia, narcissism and insecure attachment or form of cognitive bias called illusionary pattern perception. However, the current scientific consensus holds that the most theorists are not pathological precisely because of their beliefs, ultimately relying on cognitive tendencies that are neurologically hardwired in the human species and probably have developed evolutionary origins, including the natural inclinations towards anxiety and agency detection. Oh, there's a few here, isn't there? At the helicopters. So many. And I just don't want to say all of these names. It's going to... I think the algorithm's going to pick up on it. I want people to sort of see these... Ah, oh, who cares? Stuff it, let's go. Aviation. Number of theories pertain to air travel and aircraft, instances such as the 1955 of Kashmir Princess and the 1985 Arrow Flight of 1285 Crash, the 1986 Mozambique Tulip 134 Crash, and the 1987 Hel Heldenberg Disaster, the 1988 of Pan Am, the 1994 of the Melkhan. Contire helicopter, as well as various aircraft technologies and alleged sightings have all spawned theories of foul play which deviate from official verdicts. The Black Helicopter. A theory emerged in the US in the 1960s. The John Birch Society originally promoted it, assisting that the UN force would soon arrive in black helicopters to bring the US under UN control. A similar theory concerning so-called phantom helicopters appeared in the UK in the 1970s. The theory re-emerged in the 1990s during the presidency of Bill Clinton and was energetically promoted by writer Jim Keith in his book The Black Helicopters Over America. By the term of the 2000, the black helicopters become a shorthand of the anti-government theories that stretch the bounds of its credibility, such as those espoused by military groups and a number of guest talks shows hosts such as Glenn Beck. Also known as SLAP, Secret Large Scale Atmospheric Program, this theory alleges that water condensation trails from aircraft consist of chemical or agents or contain a sp supposedly toxic mix of allium, barium and strontium. Also, um, look at the chemical analysis. So this one's BA, right? Aluminium is Al, so B A A L, and S is bowels, as in the god bowels. So, under secret government policies, an estimated 17% of the people globally believe the theory to be true or partially true. In 2016, the Cardini Institute for Science published the first ever peer reviewed study of the theory. 76 out of 77 participating atmospheric chemists and geochemists stated that they had seen no evidence support the theory or stated that the theorists rely on poor sampling. Yeah, okay. Korean Airlines Flight 007, the destruction of the flight by the Soviet jets in 1983, has long drawn an interest of theorists. These theorists range from allegations of planned espionage mission to a US government cover-up to the consumption of the passengers' remains by giant crabs. Huh? I haven't heard that one. Okay. Uh, the disappearance of M. H370 in Southeast Asia in March 2014 has pro prompted many theories. One of the theories suggested that the plane was hidden away um, 
it was supposed to be at San Diego Garcia Base um, off the tip of Africa and reintroduced as a flight MH17 later the same year in order to be shot down over Ukraine for political purposes. The American theorist James H. Fetzer has placed responsibility for the disappearance with the Israel Prime Minister Benjamin Netanyahu. Historian Norman Davis promoted the theory that hackers remotely took over the Boeing Honeywell uninterruptible autopilot supposedly installed on board remotely piloting the aircraft to Antarctica. No. Well, here in Australia they were saying it went to San Diego Garcia base which is off the tip of Africa a bit higher up sort of um, took it up to 40,000 people feet the people died and then landed it Malaysian Airlines flight 17 was shot down over U- Ukraine on July 2014 the event has spawned numerous alternative theories these vary include allegations that it was secretly MH370, that the plane was actually shot down by Ukrainian Air Force to frame Ru- Russia, that it was part of a theory to conceal the truth about HIV, seven disease specialists were on board, or that the Illuminati or Israel were responsible. Deepwater Horizon, m- multiple theories pertain to the fatal or rig industrial accident in Teddy Tent in the Great Gulf of Mexico, alleging sabotage by those seeking to promote environmentalism or a strike by North Korean or Russian submarines. Elements of such theories have been suggested or promoted by US radio host Rush Limburg. New Coke, a theory claims that Coca Cola Company intentionally changed to an inferior formula of the New Coke with the intent of even driving up demand for the original product or permitting the reintroduction of the original with the new formula using cheaper ingredients. Coca-Cola President David Coe rebutted the cha- this charge. The truth is we're not that dumb, we're not that smart. The death of Nero. In ancient times, widespread theories were circulated pertaining to the death of the Roman Emperor Nero, who committed suicide in 68 AD. Some of these theories claimed that Nero had actually faked his death, but and was still actually alive, but in hiding and plotting to return to establish his reign. In most of these stories, it is said to have fled to the east, where he still loved and admired. Other theories held that Nero was really dead, but he would return from the dead to retake his home. Many com- Christians believed in the theory and feared Nero's return because Nero had viciously persecuted him. The Book of Revelation alludes to theorists surrounding Nero's alleged return and its description of slaughtered head return to life. The JFK assassination. In modern times, multiple theories containing the assassination of JFK in 1963 have merged. Vincent Bogolsi estimated that over a thousand books have been written about the assassination, at least 90% of which are works supporting the view that there was a theory. As a result of this, the Kennedy assassination has been described as the mother of all theories. Its countless individuals and organizations have been accused of involvement in the Kennedy assassination include the CIA, the Mafia, sitting President, Vice President Lyndon B. Johnson, Cuban Prime Minister Fidel Castro, the KGB, even some combination thereof. It is also frequently asserted that the United States federal government intentionally covered up crucial information in the aftermath of the assassination to prevent conspiracy from being discovered. The death of prominent figures. The results... The deaths of prominent figures of all types attract the theorists, including, for example, the theory to assassinate U.S. President Abraham Lincoln, Martin Luther King Jr., Eric V. of Denmark, Dimitri Ivanov, Sheikh Roman, Yuketz Rabin, sorry for saying these wrong, Zachary Taylor, George S. Patton, Diana, Prince as well. Some say that Princess Diana's real name is Ordine Rothschild. Hang on. Some say that this is Ordine uh, Audine Rothschild here is um, Princess Diana with the longer hair you know they say it's her you know a bit of um, cosmetic surgery um, living in the United States just the mannerism that she looks um, the bone structures all that that's her there Very tall. I wonder if that is a trans by the look of it. Just very manly features. And even the throat, the trachea there, looks like a man. The high forehead. 
the shoulders, this looks like a man. Dag Hammerscroft, Kurt Cobain, Michael Jackson, Marilyn Monroe, Tupac Shoner, Wolfgang, Artemis, John Lennon, Jimmy Hendrix, Notorious Big, Pope John Paul I, Till Dado, Olaf Plam, members of Lincoln Park, Chester Bennington, Paul Walker, David Kelly, Indian Free Freeman Fighter, Shabazz, Chandra Bose, Bollywood star, Shanset Singh Rajup. Also in existence are claims that the deaths were covered up. Such theories include Paul is dead, claimed allegedly that Paul McCartney died in a car accident in 1966 and was replaced by a lookalike Scottish orphan named William Shears Campbell, who also went by Billy Shears. And the Beatles left clues in their songs, most no noticeably Revolution 9, Strawberry Fields Forever, Glass Onion, I Am the Walrus, as well as the covers of Abbey Road, Sgt. Pepper's Lonely Hearts Band, and um, in this photo you've got the guy that... Um, wrote the Satanic Bible, Alistair Crowley up in the back in the crowd up the far left. Magical Mystery Tour. Another theory is widely circulated in Nigeria, which alleged that Nigerian President uh, Mohamed Badu died in 2017 and was replaced by a lookalike Sudanese, Sudanese imposter. Many fans of punk rock star Avril Lavigne claim that she died on the night of her fame and was replaced by a lookalike named Melissa. Melinda Tra Trump Replacement theory proposes the same former for the former US First Lady. Inverted theories containing the deaths are also known prominent along which are claims that Elvis Presley death was fake, that Aldoff survived um, the Second World War. Some say that he was actually uh, Walt Disney. Um, I know it sounds far fetched, but some people say that after the war he came to America and built Disneyland. That's what they say led to the Americas to it or to Antarctica or to the moon. Theories that Hitler had survived are known to have been deliberately promoted by the government of the Soviet Union under Stalin as part of this information campaign. The disappearance and often presumption death of individual may become cause for theories. Theories of a cover-up surrounding the 1974 disappearance of Lord Lucan following the murder of his family and many include, for example, allegations of a suicide plot whereby his body was fed to tigers at Hollow Hol Zoo. Numerous theories have also attended the 2007 disappearance of English girl Madeleine McCann. Now, Madeleine McCann's disappearance, that one, I'll show you something quickly. So, these are the images that Scot Scotland Yard put out, right? And at the same time, um, the Podesta brothers were there in Spain. Um, and these brothers are a splitting image of what um, is put out. And Ghislaine Maxwell, that's her there. See, she was... So, apparently, um, you know... Yeah. Apparently, she was kidnapped by the Podestas and Ghisl Ghislaine Maxwell. Not much said there about her. The murder of Democratic National Committee employee Seth Rich was spawned several right-wing theories, including the claim that Rich had been involved with the leaked DNC emails in 2016. Rich runs contrary to the U.S. intelligence conclusion that the leak from the DNC were part of Russian interference in U.S. elections law enforcement, as well as fact-checking websites like Political Fact. Snopes fact-check stated that these theories were false and unfounded. Um, these places are... Uh, are funded by um, the papers and they're very biased. I think um, the ones that run Snopes used to be um, well known for being porn stars, the women. Um, yeah, I don't think they really have any education. Um, the NWA theory states that the group of international elites control governments, industry and media organisation with the goal of establishing global hegemony. They are alleged to be implicated in the most of the major wars of the last two centuries to carry out secretly staged events and to deliberately manipulate economies. Organisations alleged to be part of the plot include the Federal Reserve, the Council on Foreign Relations, the Trilateral Commission, the Bilderberg, the European Union, the United Nations, the World Bank, International Money Fund, Bohemian Grove, Le Cree, Skull and Bones, um, 
there's many, many more. Um, the Jesuits, um, heaps more involved. It's 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 massive. It's the Freemasons. It's it's everywhere. Some theorists believe that the Denver International Airport stands for an underground city which serves as the headquarters of the NWO. Theorists cite the airport's unusually large size, the distance from Denver City Center, the Masonic and allegedly satanic symbols, as well as the set murals which include de 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 depictions of war and death. Um, I've made a short video showing those pictures. This is what they're talking about with the Denver airport. I'll leave these links um, in description. I've made several videos on, on a few of these topics. Um, so if you want to check them out, I'll leave the links in the description. And please um, like and subscribe and check uh, if you're my subscribers. Can you please check to see if you're still subscribed? Uh, YouTube seems to be uh, removing a lot of subscribers. So just check to see if you're still subscribed. I'd appreciate that. Thank you. So, yeah, are we creating the large uh, construction or cover-up? You know, the all-seeing eye. Underground tunnels. What are we doing? They just sort of throw it in people's face, you know. And that horse um, statue killed the man that made it, the sculpture. Same as the Vatican one, the, the statue uh, is a mirrored reverse image and it killed the, the maker. Okay, George Soros, Hungarian-American investor. George Soros has been the subject of theories since the 1990s. Soros has used his wealth to promote many political, social, social education and scientific causes, disturbing dispute to serve in grants totaling an estimated 11 billion up to 2016. However, theorists tend to assert that Soros is in control of a large portion of the world's wealth and governments, and that he secretly funds a large range of persons and organizations for nefarious purposes, such as Antifa, which is a, some theorists claim is a single far-left militant group. Such ideas have been promoted by Victor Osborne, Donald Trump, Rudy Giuliani, Joseph D. Geneva, Bill O'Reilly, Ray Moore, Alex Jones, Paul Gosar, and Ben Garrison. Soros theories are sometimes linked to anti-Semitic theories. See, they have to throw that in. He, um, when he was a boy, when World War II was going on, he used to work and um, actually helped kill his uh, fellow countrymen. He helped kill f fellow men. Freemasonry theories containing concerning Masons have prof profiligated since the 18th century. Theorists have alleged that the Masons control a large part of the economies, judiciaries and a number of countries and have alleged Masonic involvement in events surrounding the sinking of the Titanic. Crimes of Ripper and notable among theories has been American inventor Samuel Morse who in 1835 published a book of his own theories. I haven't heard about that one but I'll check it out. Um, Masons theories have been also been linked to certain anti-Semitic theories. You know, the Hegelian dialectic theories in Turkey have started to dominate public disclosure during the late reign of Justice and Development Party and recap Ergon. In 2014, Ergon coined the term, I can't say that, sorry, mastermind to denote the alleged command and the control institution somewhat ambiguously placed with the government of the United States in a comprehensive conspiracy to weaken or even dismember Turkey by orchestrating every political actor and action perceived hostile by Turkey. Ergon as well as the Daily Shabao newspaper have on multiple occasions alleged that very different non-state actors like the Cephali Hardis, the Liberation Socialist and supporters of the Futun Gulong were attacking Turkey at the same time in a well-coordinated campaign. One instance of promoting the mastermind theory occurred in February 2017 when the then mayor claimed that earthquakes in the western province of Kankakal could have been organized by dark external powers aiming to destroy Turkey's economy without official earthquake near Istanbul. Another example in 2017, the newspaper claimed that the fashion trend of ripped denim jeans was in fact a means of communication via specific forms of rips and holes between the agents of foreign states and their collaborators in Turkey. Um, there was also one where uh, Haiti 
uh, was supposed to be hit with the artificial earthquake and also uh, the Boxing Day tsunami um, was supposed to be one as well uh, using harp or something. Israel animal spying theories allege that Israel uses animals to conduct espionage or to attack people. They are often associated with theories about Zionism. Matters of interest to theories include series of shark attacks in Egypt in 2010, Hezbollah accusations of them using spying eagles, and the 2011 capture of the Griffin Vulture carrying an Israeli labelled satellite tracking device. Harold Wilson, num numerous persons including former MI5 Peter White Wright, and Soviet defector Anthony Golston have alleged that former Prime Minister Howard Wilson recently was secretly a KGB spy. Historian Christopher Andrew has eliminated that a number of people have been seduced by Goslin's fantasies. Mela Luceri, conspiracy theories containing a widespread in Pakistan eminence which originate from the 2013 satirical piece in the dawn. These theories usually allege that she is a Western spy or that her attempted murder by the in two that 2012 was a secret operation to further discredit the and was organized by her father and the CIA and carried out by actor Robert De Niro disguised as a homopathic anti-semiticism since at least the Middle Ages it has featured elements of a theory in medieval Europe it was widely believed that they poisoned the wells have been responsible for the death of Jesus and ritually consumed the blood of Christians second half of the 19th century saw the emergence of nations notions that the, the Jew or Masons were plotting to establish control over the world uh, in I think it was 1914 or 1915 there was a conference where a general got up and said we'll have to sacrifice about six million of our own but after that we'll have our own land it's in black and white film it's still around forged evidence has been presented to spread the notion that they were responsible for the propagation of communism or the hoax of the Protocol of Elders of Zion, 1903, which outlines the supposed plot by them to control the world. Such anti-Semitic theories become central to the worldwide view of Hitler. Anti-Semitic theories persist today by in nations concerning banking, Hollywood, the news media, and purported Zionist occupation government. These theories have tyrannical worldview in common. Holocaust denial is considered anti-Semitic conspiracy because it's in position that the Holocaust is a hoax designed to advance the interests of them, justify the creation of the State of Israel. Their deniers include former Iranian pres President Mohammad Hamidjid, the convicted chemist Guma Rudolph, and the discredited author David Irving. Irving. Anti-Armenianism. Theories that allege that the Armenians' world's secret political power are prevalent in Azerbaijan and have been promoted by the government, including President Turkish Foreign Minister has claimed that the Russian media is run by the Armenians. American writer and disbarred lawyer Samuel Weems has claimed that the Ameri Armenian genocide was a hoax designed to defraud Christian nations of billions of dollars and that the Armenian church instigated the attacks. Filmmaker David Amru has accused the Armenians of plotting against Azerbaijan and has claimed that the Kar Karabakh movement was a plot by the CIA to destroy the Soviet Union. Anti-Buddhism Iran's bra, I can't say that, sorry, minority has been the target of theories alleging involvement with hostile powers and the government officials. Others have claimed that they have been widely, very voraciously agents of the Russian, British, American, Israel governments. And a, I can't say that, sorry, an historically inaccurate book published in Iran entitled The Memoirs of Count details the theory that it, they intend to destroy Islam. Such accusations have been dismissed as having no factual foundation. Anti-Catholics. Anti Since the Protestant Reformation of the 16th century, anti-Catholic theories have been taken in many forums, including the 17th century Polish plot uh, uh, allegations claimed by persons such as William Blackstone at the Catholics posed a secret threat to Britain. Numerous writings by authors such as Samuel Morse, Rebecca Reed, Avro Manhattan, Jack Chick, Alberto River, Theorists often claim that the Pope is the Antichrist because 
They accused Catholics of suppressing evidence incompatible with the church teachings and described Catholics as being involved with the secret evil rituals, crimes and other plots. In 1853, Scottish minister Alexandra Hillslop published his anti-Catholic pamphlet, The Two Babylons, which he claims the Catholic Church is secretly con continuation of the pagan religion of ancient Babylon, the, the product of millennial theories founded by the biblical king Nimrod and the Assyrian queen Samarius. It is also claimed that modern Catholic holidays, including Christmas and Easter, are actually pagan festivals established by the Sumerians and the customs associated with them by pagan rituals. Modern scholars have unanimously rejected the Book of argu Arguments as Uranus and biased and flawed understanding of Babylonian religion, but variations of them are still accepted among some groups as evangelical Protestants and the Jehovah Witness periodical, the Watchtower frequently publishes experts from it until the 1880s. The book thesis has also featured predominantly in the theories of racist groups such as the Convent, the Sword and the Arm of the Lord. Um, the, the Catholics are uh, Jesuits and the Pope swears like opposite to what he says. And apparently the Catholics created um, Islam in the 1800s to go up against the Christians um, in the end times. Christmas is the Saturnalia festival. I'll leave a link in the description for that one. I made a video about that one. Um, same as Easter. Easter is about for Esther, the fertility god. Um, Jesus was supposed to be born in September, uh, not December. Fears of the Catholic takeover of the U.S. has been especially persistent, prompted by phenomena such as the Catholic immigration of the 19th century and the KKK propaganda. Such fears attached to the Catholic uh, political candidates such as Al Smith and the JFK. Pope John Paul I died in September 1978, only a month after his election to the papacy. The time of his death and the Vatican's alleged difficulties with ceremonial and legal death procedures has fostered several theories. The elderly Pope Benedict's resignation in February 2013 for given reasons of a lack of strength of mind and body prompted theorists in Italian publications such as La Repubblica and Panorama that he resigned in order to avoid alleged scandal involving the underground gay Catholic network. There's a lot more to that too. Check out the video I made about um, the Vatican. Uh, it's a star fort and it's the key laid out as a key and the sculptures and the snake hall. I'll leave the links in the description. Antichrist. Uh, Apocalypse prophecies, particularly Christian claims about the end times, have inspired a range of theories. Many of those cite the Antichrist, a leader who will supposedly create an oppressive world empire. Countless figures have been called Antichrist, including the Holy Emperor and Roman Emperor Frederick II, Russia Emperor Peter the Great, Saldan, Pope John, Mussolini, Barack Obama, French Emperor Napoleon, and German Führer Hitler. Bible theories uh, posit that significant parts of the New Testament are false or have been omitted. Various groups, both real, such as the Vatican, and fake, such as the Pyrrha Siren, are said to have suppressed relevant information concerning, for example, the dating of the Shroud of Turin. Much of the line of the theory has been stimulated or debunked by the book titled The Holy Blood and the Holy Grail, 1982, which claimed that Jesus and Mary Magdalene were lovers and that their offspring and descendants were secretly hidden in Europe following the death of Jesus, from who they mean living with French doors. Draftsman Pierre Planted claimed descendant. Interest in the hoax saw a resurgent publication of the publication of Dan Brown's 2003 novel, The Da Vinci Code. Uh, this photo of Jesus, um, now I made a video about it. If you split this image in half, there's two faces. So there's two men in that photo. So on one side, it's supposed to be Jesus, and on the other side, it's supposed to be his cousin, I think it is, or it might be his brother, I can't remember, but I'll dig out the video. I made a video a long time ago about it. They like to hold, hide a lot of uh, symbols in their paintings and messages. War on Islam is a conspiracy um, in Islam discourse which 
describes alleged plot to either harm or annihilate the social system with Islam. The perpetrators of this theory alleged to be non-Muslims and false Muslims, allegedly in collusion with political actors in the Western world. While this theory is often referred to in relation to the modern social problems and changes, the Crusades are often presented as its starting point. Paul the Apostle Paul the Apostle makes an appearance in some variants of the medieval Jewish anti-Christian plumic titled Yoshua as particularly effective spy for the rabbis. Muslims see Paul's father was a uh, high up uh, preacher too. Muslims have long believed that Paul purposely corrupted the original revealed teaching of Jesus through the introduction of such elements as paganism, the making of Christianity into a theology of the cross and introducing original sin and the need for redemption. The Baal faith regards Paul as a false or misguided preacher who eventually corrupted Jesus' original message. In a sense, he is seen is seen as the real Judas that Jesus said he would betray him. Racism While genocide, genocide theory and its white nationalist notion that immigration, integration, low fertility rates and abortion are being promoted in predominantly white countries in order to turn white people into a minority and cause their extinction. In 2017, a study in France by IFOP, for example, found that 48% of the participants believe that political and media elites are conspiring to replace people, white people with immigrants. In the United States, the black holds a theory holds the view that the African Americans are the victims of the genocide instituted by white Americans. Lynchings and racial discrimination were formally described as genocide by the Civil Rights Congress in 1951. Malcolm X also talked about black genocides in the early 1960s. Public funding of the pill was also described as a black genocide, the first black power conference in 1967. 19, and in 1970, after the abortion was mildly legal widely legalized, some black militants depicted abortion as being part of the conspiracy. Some Rastafari maintain the view that the white racial patriarchy, Babylon, controls the world in order to oppress the black people. See my video, uh, 400 Years a Slave, about the Moors. I'll leave the links in the description. They believe that the empire how to say, Socio of Ethiopia did not die in 1975, instead believing that the allegedly racist media propagated false reports of his death in order to quash the Rastafari movement. And this man's a Freemason. Look at all of his Freemasonry regalia. And you know these countries are all working together when they've got all this regalia on. Some Rastafari maintain that the view that white races... Uh, I read that one, sorry. The plan is alleged plot by white power brokers in Washington, D.C. to take back the city's local government from African Americans, who are a majority of the city's population from the 1950s to the early 2010s, and remain its largest ethnic group. The theory asserts that the decline of low-income black residents and the replacement of but wealthier whites from outside the city is intentional through the calculated use of gentrification, urban renewal. Most city residents, regardless of race, consider the plan to be false, but some believe it's a cop has quite considerable support among the black residents in the influence of lost elections. Extraterrestrials and UFOs. Along the foremost concerns of the theorists are questions of alien life, for example, allegations of government cover-ups, supposed Ros Roswell UFO incident or actively activity at Area 51. Also disseminated are theories containing so-called men in black, who allegedly silence witnesses. Multiple reports of their cattle found by absent body parts and seemingly drained of blood have emerged worldwide since at least the 1960s. The phenomena has spawned theories variously containing alien secret government or military experiments. Prominent among such theorists is Linda Moulton Howe, author of The Alien Harvest, 1989. Many theorists have drawn to inspiration from the writings of ancient astronaut, proper proponent, Zachariah Stitchin, who declared that the Anunnaki from Sumerian mythology were actually a race of extraterrestrial beings who came to Earth around 500,000 years ago in order to mine gold. In his 1964 book, Humanity's Extraterrestrial Origins, E.T. Influences in Humankind's Biological and Cultural Evolution, Arthur Horne proposed that the Anunnaki were a race of blood-drinking, shape-shifting alien reptiles. This theory was adapted and elaborated on by British theory David Icke, who, Icke, who who maintains that the British Bush family, Margaret Thatcher, Bob Hoke, and the British royal family, and the British royal family are Rothschilds. 
they did a deal with the original king and queen of England when they were bankrupt in the 1600s. They did a 200-year deal where the Rothschilds would get them out of bankruptcy if they could run the country. Among others were such creatures or have been under their control. Ex critics have suggested that reptilians may have been seen as anti-Semitic code word, a charge he has denied. Government, politics and conflict. In modern era, political spirit theories are often spread using fake news on social media. 2017, a study of fake news published by Shorenstein Center found that misinformation is currently predominantly a uh, pathology of the right. Political theories may take a generalized and wide-ranging forms of concerning wars, international bodies, but may be also seen at localized levels, such as theories pertaining to the 118th Battalion, a British regiment stationed in Kuchina, Kitchener, Ontario, Ontario during World War One, which is believed by some in Kitchener still be present in controlling local politics. Crisis actors. Crisis actors are individuals who portray disaster victims in the first responder training exercises. Theory alleges their involvement in staging of false mass shootings or similar events wherein the victims and their families are in fact crisis actors. The Illuminati. Illuminati. Theorists concerning the Illuminati, a short-lived 18th century Enlightenment era secret society, appeared to have originated in the late 19th century when some conservatives in Europe came to believe that the group had been responsible for the French Revolution. Hoaxes about the Illuminati were later spread in 1960 by a group of American practical jokers known as the Disordians, who, for example, wrote a series of fake letters about the Illuminati to Playboy. I think the, the John Birch Society would be involved in that as well, but the Freemasons and um, the Rosicrucians were actually teamed up to... Uh, Freemasons, Jacobsons, and the Rosicrucians all got together to take down the French royalty. False flag operations. False flag operations are covert operations designed to appear as if they're being carried out by other entities. Some allegations of false flag operations have been verified or have been subject to a legitimate historical dispute, such as the 1933 Reichstag arson attack. Discussions of some state substantiated allegations of such operations feature strongly in theory of discourse. Other allegations of similar operations have attached to the bombing of Pearl Harbor, the Oklahoma City bombing, the 2004 Madrid train bombings, the Gulf of Token incident. Also, the Boston Marathon bombings was in it as well. Um, there are so many that, um, you know, we've had several here in Australia with uh, Port Arthur, um, that bloke that killed several people with the car, um, Burke Street. There's so many. 9-11, uh, the multiple attacks made the U.S. terrorists using hijacked aircraft on the 11th of September have proved attractive to the theories. Theories may include reference uh, to a missile or hologram technology by far the most common theory is that the attacks were in fact controlled demolitions a theory which has been rejected by the engineering profession and the 911 commission now I'll just quickly show you something hang on this is what kicked off like with the demolition um, uh, the Israeli 90, uh, art student project on the 91st floor this is boxes of jelly night um, so what they did is they took a window out. In the period leading up to U the 9-11, the US group of Israelis, non-US citizens, managed to secure temporary construction passes to perform work on the 91st floor of Larry Pull-Up, Pullet Silverstein's Lease World Trade Center. These passes gave them access to the entire complex. The pretense was an art project called the B-Thing, and the group is called Delton. Delton, yeah. After securing their passes, Jelton proceeded to remove the heavy windows of a of an office space on the 91st floor and purported to reconstruct a prefab balcony outside the building. They then stretched putty around the windows and filmed it by a helicopter as if it as a stunt, shown here on August 8th to 18th, 2001. The New York Times even felt strangely compelled to cover the story. It and considered it newsworthy or a backstory. On the right is a photograph of the balcony as shown in the newspaper article. So they took out the window, made a balcony, and they all done sorts of moves. Like one bloke was hanging upside down, pretending to fall. Um, this may sound innocent enough for fake dumb artists, except for the fact the photos taken by the artist's book called The Bee Thing and used in the Times article from inside the 91st floor camp 
out revealed boxes stacked to the ceiling with the letters and numbering of BB18 on the side. BB18 is the model number for a fuse holder accessory as described. Purpose is to save space and workload in a compelled wiring situation, decreases wiring ter terminations, small footprint, reduces space requirements, reduces assembly time, prevents accidental finger exposure, quick and safe method for changing fuse holder configurations, allows for future expansions, improves troubleshooting, eliminates power distribution block. This is all gelinite. Also, take note that the ceiling tiles have been totally removed and exposed to steel girders. The following little gem on the right of the falling creature and perhaps a calling card was induced as the opposite of egotistical self-absorbing a freakish book. The impact points of the planes were at the 93rd and 98th floor. Below is a cartoon physics of an artist's imprint created by its aluminium wings that could not position cut the steel exterior of the columns. Buried and apparently long forgotten in this 2002 Daily Mail story about the US arresting and deporting 200 Israelis, some of whom proposed as art students for spying and espionage activities in the lead up to. In addition, here is the DAA's report on Israel activities in the US just prior and so much of the nonsensical theory that 19 Muslims with, yeah. I'll leave this one in the description for you, but... Um, There's just so much, yeah, check it out, like, they lit it up at night, put E-Team, and you zoom in on these pictures, and you can see it's gelatin. That's the balcony they did, where they went out on the balcony. I'm not even going to mention this one because I don't want the video to get taken down. This is not debating whether they happened or not happened. This is for educational purposes in sharing um, what people say about it. Um, I'm not even going to mention these ones either. Um, FEMA. There is many subject theories including the allegations that the organisation has been engaged in building uh, camps on the US soil and events for the imprisonment imposition of martial law and genocide. Members of the South African National Congress Party have long propagated theories frequently concerning the CIA and the alleged white supremacists. In 2014, Deputy, Deputy Minister of Defence joined others accusing, without evidence, public prosecutor of being a US agent working f to create puppet government in South Africa. I'm not even going to mention this one either. Cultural Marx Marxism, the intellect group known as the Frankfurt School, which emerged in the 1930s, has increased, increasingly been the subject of theories which have alleged the promotion of, in its capitalism societies, the term cultural Marxism has been notably employed by conservative American movements such as the Tea Party and Norwegian mass murderer. The Deep State. While the term is occasionally used as a neutral term to denote a nation's but bureaucracy, the conspiral notion of a deep state is a concept originating principality in Middle East and in North African politics with the same basis in truth and has been known in the US since 1960s. It has been revived under the Trump presidency. The deep state, in a letter sense, refers to an unidentified powerful elite who acts in coordination and manipulation of the nation's policies, government, Proponents of such theories have included Canadian author Peter Dale Scott and has promoted the idea of US since at least the 1990s, as well as Breitbart News, InfoWars, and former US President Donald Trump. 2017 poll by ABC News and Washington Post indicated that 48% of Americans believe the existence of conspiratorial deep state in the US. Sutherland Springs. Sutherland Springs 2017 church had also been subject to multiple theories. The shooter had been linked to multiple theories, such as identifying him as a Democrat, Hillary supporter, Bernie supporter, anti left supporter, um, claiming he'd carried a flag, told church goes, this is a revolution. Some reporters also falsely claimed that he targeted the church because they were white conservatives. Um, beginning of 2017, a sprawling theory emerged on 
thing was spread by right-wing message boards websites then Breitbart Fox News then president and his allies the theory holds that both Ukraine and then Russia interfered with the 2016 elections and then vice president had interfered intervened to protect a company in which his son was involved the New Yorker found that reporting the, the in the right wing media was initiated by Peter Shaw Swisser a former Breitbart News contributor and president of the government accountability institute a self-styled corruption watchdog that group that chaired to fund a conservative Mega donor Rebecca Mercer and founded by Steve Bannon. Stolen election theory. I'm not even going to go on about that. Um, I'm not going to go on about this either because I don't want to get struck for misinformation or anything. Fluoridation. There is controlled addition of fluoride in public water supply to reduce tooth decay. Although many dental health organisations support such fluoridation practices, opposed to by theorists, alleg allegations may include claims that it has been a way to dispose of industrial waste or that it exists to obscure a failure to protect dental care failure to provide dental care to the poor, a further theory promoted by the J.B. John Birch Society in the 1960s to describe fluoridation as a plot to weaken the American population. It makes, apparently it makes them docile and not argumentative and all that kind of stuff. I'm not even going to mention this one. Um, theory typically alleges that science is behind it and has been invented or distorted for logical and financial reasons. Many have promoted such theories, including former President Donald Trump, U.S. Senator John Eidenhoff, British Journal Christopher Booker, and Viscount Christopher Mockton. Numerous theories pertain to real or alleged weather control situate projects. Theories include the debunker search that HARP, a radio technology research program funded by the US government, is a secret weather controlling system. Some theorists have blamed 2005 har Hurricane Tr Katrina on HARP. HARP has also been suggested to somehow cause earthquakes such as the 2010 Haiti, the 2011 um, one, and I think Fukushima, yeah, and 2013 Um Also, a list interest to the theories are cloud seeding techniques. These include the bunk. These include a debunked allegation that the British military project Cumulus Korea caused the fatal 1952 Limith flood in Devon, England, and claims concerning a secret project is said to have caused the 2010 Pakistan floods. Now, this stuff does exist, the weather modification. Now, this is David Miles from Miles Research. He's from Queensland, Toowoomba, Queensland, here in Australia. Uh, he offered the Australian government he could end the drought for a hundred million. He didn't have to get paid up front if he made it rain and break the drought. He said he'd do it for a hundred million, and the government refused. They totally refused to do it. So he knows how to do it. He's been over in um, Africa, the Middle East, uh, Saudi Arabia, doing stuff, and yeah, he's getting there. It just this technology they the government uses it but they don't want the general public to know about it and use it I'll leave the link in the description for you MK Ultra German genuine American research in the 1950s and the 1960s into chemical interrogation and mind control techniques were followed by many theorists and like Project Monarch especially following the CIA director Richard Helms 1973 order to destroy all files related to the project these theories include allegation that there were mass fatality at Jonestown in 1978 was connected to the MK Ultra project the Flat Earth first emerged in the 19th century England, despite the Earth's superior nature having been known since at least the time of Pythagoras. It has, in recent years, been promoted by American software consult Mark Sargent through the use of YouTube videos. The Flat Earth, the conspiracy theories, hold the pla planet Earth is not a sphere, that the evidence has been faked or suppressed to hide the fact that it is instead a disk or a single infinite plane. They often implicate NASA, others claim it includes that GPS devices are rigged to make aircraft pilots wrongly believe they are flying around the globe. RFID chips, such as implanted into pets or as a means of tracking, have drawn, in, drawn the interest of theorists who persist that this technology is secretly and widely being implanted in humans. Former Whoopi England town councillor Simon Parks has promoted this theory, which may be related to theories concerning that and banking and the Antichrist. Technology suppression theories 
pertain that the alleged suppression of certain technologies and energies such theories may focus on the real society theory allegations that suppress the electric car by fossil fuel companies as detailed in the 2006 documentary who killed the electric car and the Phoebus cartel set up in 1924 which has been accused of suppressing longer lasting light bulbs the other long-standing allegations include the suppression of the perpetual motion and cold fusion technology by government agencies special interest groups or fraudulent inventors promote the alternative theories have included Thomas Henry Moray Eugene Malov or a convicted of American fraudster Stanley Meyer. Weaponry. The theorists often attain to new military technology, both real and imagined. Subjects of theorists include the allegation of the Philadelphia experiment, uh, supposed to attempt to turn a U.S. Navy warship invisible, the alleged Montec project, a supposed government program to learn about the mind control and time terrible, and the so-called tsunami bomb, which led to a cause of the 2004 Indian Ocean tsunami. Other theories include Peter Vongel's debunked claim of accidental explosion of conventional munitions at Port Chicago was in fact a nuclear detonation, and the theory promoted by the Venezuelan state-run TV, Vivi, that the 2010 Haitian earthquake was caused by a secret U.S. earthquake weapon. Targeted individuals. Some theorists claim that the government agents are utilizing directed energy weapons and controlled electronic surveillance to harass members of the population. Theorists often cite research into psychotronic weapons, the Cuban health attacks and microwave or auditory effect as proof of their theory. These are over there are over 10,000 people who identify as target individuals. The target individual phenomenon has been featured on episodes of the theory with Jesse Ventura of the History Channel in search for False history. Some theorists claim that the dates of historical events have been deliberately distorted. These include the Phantom Timeline Hypothesis. Um, that's uh, I made a video about that one. It's um, where they basically added a thousand years. Joseph Justice Gallagher changed it. I'll drop links in for these for you. Herbert Hilling, who in 1991 published the allegation that 207, no, it's 1,300 years all up because the Pope moved a thousand and this guy done 300. Because of the age of Taurus, it, it, it was out by 300 or something. Uh, 297 years have been added to the calendar by establishment figures such as Pope Sylvester in order to position themselves at the millennium. Comparable th theory, known as new chronology, is mostly associated with Russian theorist Antony Fomenko. Fomenko holds the th that history in many centuries... History is many centuries shorter than it is widely believed and that numerous historical documents have been fabricated and legitimate documents destroyed for political ends. Adherents of such ideas have included chess grandmaster Gary Kaspopi. Out of space. Scientific space programs are particularly interest to the theorists. Most prosthetic theorists allege that US moon landings were staged in a NASA film studio with some alleging involvement of director Stanley Kubrick. And don't forget the movie's uh, eyes wide shut that Stanley Kubrick made and he died not long after that. The Soviet space program has also attracted theories that the government concealed evidence of failed flights. Um, check out UAP's videos on NASA's trying to get rockets and they were, they were just fake. They were little um, dioramas made. Uh, he, he caught them out. A real recent theory emerged emergent following the activities of hacker Gary McKinnon suggests that the secret program of crewed space fleets exists, supposedly acting under the UN. Theorists have long preposted the plot by organizations such as NASA, never a straight answer to conceal the existence of a large planet in the solar system known as Nibiru or Planet X, which is alleged to have passed close enough to the Earth and destroy it. Predictions for the date of destruction have included 2003, 2012, 2017. The theory began to develop following the publication of the 12th planet in 1976 by Russian amateur author Zachary Stitchin, who was given its full form by Nancy Leiter. Leiter is in Liar. It has thus been seen promoted by the American theorist in the end times, David Mead. The notion received renewed attention during the period prior to the eclipse in 2017. Other theorists in 2017 also predicted it would appear, including Terrell Croft on YouTube, Pastor Paul Bangley. Um, Steve Quayle has actually been going on about it for some time, but Steve Quayle has sort of dropped off and not doing as much preaching as he used to. And Zen... 
Um, he's been going through a pretty hard time too. Boxing has featured in theories such claims that the second Elstead fight and the Bradley Preco fight were fixed. Pretty much all sports fixed and set up. Sherigo, the theft and the disappearance of Irish boxer. Irish bred racehorse Sherigo in 1883 has prompted many theorists to speculate about involvement of the Mafia, IOA, and Colonial Gaddafi. Rigged selection process. The phrase at Envelope 3 suggests that the National Basketball Association rigged its 1985 draft lottery so that Patrick Ewing would join the New York Kits. Theorists claim that the lottery envelope was chilled so that it could be identified by touch. A similar Hot ball theory promoted by Scottish football member David Moyes suggests that certain balls used in the draws for UEFA competitions have been warmed to achieve specific outcomes. The 1984 Firecracker 400, the Daytona International Speedway, Daytona, Florida, was first NASCAR race to be attended by US Senate President Ronald Reagan and was driver Richard Pretty's 200th and final career victory. Rival driver Carl Juttenberg's premature retirement into the pit road has prompted conspiracy theorists to allege that organisers fixed the race in order to receive good publicity for the event. Ronaldo at the 1998 World Cup Final. On the day of the 1998 World Cup Final, the Brisbane's Brazilian striker, Ronaldo, suffered a convulsive fit. Ronaldo was initially removed from the starting lineup 72 minutes before the match, with the team sheet released to a stunned world media. Before he was reinstated by the Brazil coach shortly before kickoff, Ronaldo sleepwalked through the final with France winning the game. The nature of the incident set a trail of questions and allegations which persisted for years, with Alex Bellos writing in The Guardian. When Ronaldo's health scare was revealed after the match, the situation's unique circumstances lent itself to a fabulous theory. He was the world's most famous sportsman, about to take part in the most important match of his career, where suddenly, unexpectedly, he fell ill. Was it stress, epilepsy, or had he been drugged? Questions circulated into who made Ricardo play the game. The Brazilian coach insisted he had the final say, but so, but much speculation focused on sportswear company Nike, Brazilian multi-million dollar sponsor, who many Brazilians thought had too much control, putting pressure on the striker to play against medical advice. The New England Patriots. The New England Patriots have also been involved in numerous series during the nineteen eight during the AFL championship twenty four to twenty victory over Jacksonville Jaguars, several theorists spread stating that the referees helped the Patriots advance to the Super Bowl in twenty seventeen. However, sports analyst Stephen A. Smith stated that the Jaguars were not robbed, but they had no one to blame but themselves for the loss. There was also a theorist regarding the Super Bowl. 17 matchup between the Patriots and the Atlanta Falcons stating that the game was rigged while others said that the Falcons made questionable play clause at the end of the game that resulted in them blowing a 28-3 lead so there you go I, I hope you find that was interesting and, and just you know give you some uh, insight to when people are talking about things um, you know it gives you some insight to know what they're talking about so I'm going to drop some of these links in the um, description of what what happened in the world and um, hopefully I'll see you in the next one thanks for watching raise your vibrations much love bye now